Urban Foxes Fancy an ongoing collection UK wildlife videos? Too easy. Just take a quick moment to subscribe and click the bell icon and you will never miss out again. Ok in this video we are going to look at urban foxes. Where do urban foxes live? Foxes dig out dens to provide a safe underground space that is mostly used for raising fox cubs, also called kits. In urban areas, the dens, known as earths, are commonly located under sheds, but they can also be among tree roots, in bushes or on railway embankments. We have had a family living under our shed for the past few years. What do urban foxes eat? Foxes are mainly carnivorous, so most of their diet consists of small animals. Foxes feed on things like mice, birds, voles, eggs and amphibians. Foxes seem to particularly enjoy eating wild apples. Foxes will eat whatever you leave for them, just keep in mind that other animals may get to the food first so try to avoid onions, garlic, chocolate, and the other foods you wouldn't give a dog. Where do foxes go in the day? During the daytime, foxes usually rest somewhere, perhaps under bushes, in the lower branches of a tree, in a sunny spot on a low roof or under a garden shed. Should I be worried about a fox in my garden? Foxes are not dangerous to humans, except when they are rabid. Which is very rare. Or when they are captured and handled. A fox cutting through your garden is probably just passing through on their way between hunting areas and no action is necessary on your part. What attracts foxes to your garden? Like every wildlife and vermin that come onto your property, foxes too, are attracted to it because of the presence of food and water. Dot. Some people even prefer to attract foxes to their gardens because they may also catch and feed on pigeons and rats, which are a bigger nuisance to some households. What is the average lifespan of a fox? Three to four years in the wild. Why do foxes scream at night? Foxes scream and bark to communicate with each other. This becomes more common during mating season, which is at its peak in January. The most common reason that foxes scream is to attract a mate and during the mating process. Fox is nocturnal, so this is when they are most active. Our furry little friends in the forest are not just cute, there are some things about foxes that not everyone knows. Foxes would be great triathletes. Red foxes can run up to 31 miles per hour, jump over 6 feet high fences, and they can even swim. Their tail is over half its body length. 70% of its head and body length long, to be exact. Fox's forepaws have five toes, while their hind feet only have four. Females are called vixens. Meanwhile, males are called dog foxes, and young foxes are called cubs, pups, or kits. Foxes have supersonic hearing. Well, almost. They can hear crows in flight from up to a third of a mile away, a grouse changing roosts at 600 paces, and even a little mouse squeak from 100 meters away. Reportedly, they can even hear a watch ticking from 40 yards away. Generally foxes choose one mate to be with for their whole life. They are monogamous. When afraid, foxes grin. It is a sign of submission, along with arching their backs and bringing themselves lower to the ground while laying their ears back. They don't make good pets. Wild animals are meant to live in the wild. Simple as that. When it comes to foxes, many cubs are adopted by people who mean well, but it's unlikely that the cubs were abandoned by their mother in the first place. Always respect nature, give them space and trust in the fox's instinct, they will take care of their babies. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more wildlife videos.